tell me you'll marry me. Oh. The way you kiss, how can I refuse? Mr. Hunter. Mr. Hunter. Welcome back to Hollywood Secrets, where we explore the timeless classics that have shaped the world of cinema. Today, we're diving into 1952, a year filled with some of the most iconic films in Hollywood history. From unforgettable musicals to intense dramas, these are the top 10 movies of 1952 that continue to captivate audiences. Let's get started. Singing in the Rain Singing in the Rain is a vibrant musical set in Hollywood's transition from silent films to talkies. It follows the story of a silent film star, Don Lockwood, who must navigate the challenges of the new era alongside his co-stars and the lovable Kathy Selden. Gene Kelly's iconic dance in the rain was filmed while he had a fever of 103 degrees, yet his performance remains one of the most celebrated in cinema history. The film's production was a massive undertaking, blending elaborate choreography with comedic timing and a love for Hollywood's golden age. Considered one of the greatest musicals ever made, Singing in the Rain has influenced countless filmmakers and remains a symbol of Hollywood's glamour and creativity. High Noon In this taut western, Marshall Will Kane is set to retire and leave town with his new bride. However, when he learns that a deadly gang is arriving on the noon train, he must face them alone as the townspeople refuse to stand by him. Gary Cooper's Oscar-winning performance as Will Kane was characterized by a quiet intensity that set a new standard for Western heroes. The film's real-time pacing added a unique layer of suspense, making it a landmark in the genre. High Noon is often seen as an allegory for the political climate of the 1950s, particularly the era of McCarthyism. Its themes of courage, honor, and moral integrity resonate just as strongly today. The Quiet Man This romantic drama tells the story of Sean Thornton, an American boxer who returns to his Irish roots and falls in love with the fiery Mary Kate Danaher. Their passionate relationship is complicated by local traditions and her stubborn brother. Directed by John Ford, The Quiet Man was a labor of love that took years to bring to the screen. The lush Irish countryside serves as a stunning backdrop to the film's sweeping romance and the chemistry between John Wayne and Maureen O'Hara is undeniable. The Quiet Man won two Academy Awards and has since become a beloved classic, celebrated for its heartwarming story and beautiful cinematography. The Greatest Show on Earth This epic film takes viewers behind the scenes of a traveling circus, focusing on the lives of its performers and the challenges they face. The film blends drama, romance, and spectacle, culminating in a dramatic train crash sequence. Directed by Cecil B. DeMille, the film featured real circus performers and elaborate set pieces that captured the grandeur and danger of the circus life. It was a massive box office hit and won the Academy Award for Best Picture. Though it has its critics, The Greatest Show on Earth remains a significant piece of cinema history, reflecting the era's fascination with large scale grandiose productions. Rashomon Akira Kurosawa's Rashomon tells the story of a crime from four different perspectives, each offering a different version of the events. The film explores the nature of truth and the unreliability of memory. Kurosawa's innovative use of camera techniques, such as shooting directly into the sun, added a dreamlike quality to the film. Rashomon introduced Japanese cinema to the world and won an honorary Academy Award for its powerful storytelling. Rashomon has had a profound influence on filmmaking, inspiring countless directors and introducing the Rashomon effect in storytelling, where multiple perspectives create ambiguity. Limelight Written, directed by, and starring Charlie Chaplin, Limelight is the poignant story of a washed-up comedian, Calvero who befriends a young dancer and helps her regain her confidence while facing his own fading career. This was Chaplin's last film made in America before he was forced into exile. The film features a rare collaboration between Chaplin and his longtime rival Buster Keaton, in a scene that is both humorous and touching. 
Limelight is considered one of Chaplin's most personal films, reflecting his own fears and insecurities. Its themes of aging and redemption continue to resonate with audiences today. The Bad and the Beautiful This drama offers a behind-the-scenes look at the dark side of Hollywood, following the rise and fall of a ruthless film producer who manipulates everyone around him to achieve success. Directed by Vincente Minnelli and starring Kirk Douglas, the film's portrayal of the film industry was both glamorous and cynical, giving audiences a glimpse into the cutthroat world of Hollywood. The Bad and the Beautiful won five Academy Awards and remains a critical favorite, often cited as one of the best films about filmmaking. Ekiru Another masterpiece by Akira Kurosawa, Ekiru follows the story of a bureaucrat who, after learning he has terminal cancer, embarks on a journey to find meaning in his remaining days. He decides to leave behind a lasting legacy by building a playground in a neglected neighborhood. Kurosawa's use of non-linear storytelling and deep humanism made Akiru a profound meditation on life and death. The performance by Takashi Shimura as the lead character is one of the most moving in cinema history. Akiru is widely regarded as one of the greatest films ever made, and its exploration of mortality and the search for purpose continues to inspire filmmakers and audiences alike. Moulin Rouge Set in the bohemian world of 1890s Paris, Moulin Rouge tells the story of the artist Henri de Toulouse-Lautrec, who frequents the famous cabaret and captures its lively atmosphere in his paintings, all while dealing with his own personal struggles. Directed by John Huston, the film was praised for its vivid color palette and innovative cinematography, which brought the decadent world of the Moulin Rouge to life. Moulin Rouge was a critical and commercial success, influencing later portrayals of Parisian nightlife in cinema and reinforcing John Huston's reputation as a master director. The Snows of Kilimanjaro Based on the short story by Ernest Hemingway, The Snows of Kilimanjaro tells the story of a writer reflecting on his life and loves while on a safari in Africa, facing the possibility of death. The film's sweeping cinematography and powerful performances by Gregory Peck and Susan Hayward brought Hemingway's story to life, capturing both the beauty and the melancholy of the African landscape. The Snows of Kilimanjaro remains a notable adaptation of Hemingway's work, celebrated for its emotional depth and visual grandeur. And that's our list of the top 10 movies of 1952. These films represent a diverse range of genres and styles, each contributing something unique to the world of cinema. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to Hollywood Secrets for more deep dives into the greatest films of all time. Until next time, keep the magic of the movies alive.